Hello everyone, Jim Roy here with Lux Manor Real Estate. So today we're going to talk about what happens when water is backing up into the lowest sink. Now I owned a condo in a building with two floors above me and my tenant called me to say that water was backing up into her sink and immediately I asked her to go. It wasn't coming from her faucet and I asked her to go to the neighbors upstairs and please ask them to stop running their faucets. So I called the condo association, they sent out a plumber, the plumber snaked the line, and then they sent me the bill. Now after a lengthy discussion with the plumber, he finally saw it my way, that there was no possible way that water was backing up here if this faucet isn't running and it's my problem to pay the bill. It's the condo association's responsibility, of which I was a member, so to some degree I was paying for it, but I shouldn't have to pay the entire bill. So basically what I explained to him was that the water must be coming from one of the floors above and joining the stack line to which all of these faucets connect. And the water was coming down and hitting a clog here and backing up to the lowest drain, which is mine. Now, as I mentioned, you might see this in your single family home. If you're running water upstairs, and water's backing up into your basement tub or something like that. In this case, it was a condo association, same principle, where there was one stack line where the water was coming out and backing up, backing up, filling up the pipe until it found another place to go that was easier. So they tried to say that, no, 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 it was within the drywall and therefore your responsibility. And I said, look, if I've got a clog here, there's no way water could be entering the system unless it was coming from my faucet, which it wasn't. If there happened to be two clogs at the same time, then water would find its way here, find my clog, and then go back up to the next lowest drain, in this case, the floor above me. So, as I mentioned after a long discussion, they saw it my way, the condo association paid the invoice, but they really tried to stick me with the bill, and this is why it's important that I'm making this video. So in case this is happening to you, you can send them this video and explain to them, no, it's in the common pipe outside of your drywall as this is happening. And we don't know who it was that put the item down the drain. Maybe this guy put grease and coffee grounds down the drain, and this guy was running his water that hit the clog caused by this person, but it's the lowest unit that's going to feel the ramifications. So if you like the quality and efficiency of this video, contact a Luxman or Realtor the next time you're ready to buy or sell a home, and remember to like and subscribe.